How much does it cost to get a cut like a basketball superstar? Well, hold on to your wallets as we step inside the barbershop and find out the crazy cost of NBA haircuts. NBA stars have expensive tastes, from their cribs to their kicks. Basketball players know how to splash the cash, and they don't slow down the spending when they hit the salon. Ballers in the world's best basketball league have been known to pay insane amounts for their hairdos. A player's cut can cost anywhere from a reasonable 100 bucks to $3,000. And that's not including the travel costs that the best cut creators rack up. Some players fly their favorite barbers out when they're on the road, and some are so superstitious that they stick with the very same barber no matter what city they're in. When Kemba Walker was lighting up the league as a Charlotte Hornet, he would fly his hometown barber all the way from the Bronx to North Carolina anytime he needed a trim. So Kemba was paying for a fade and airfare. Chris Dunn did the same with his chosen chopper, flying them out to Chicago every other week. And this is when he was still a rookie. Hairstyles aren't just about the aesthetics for basketball stars though. What it comes down to is that in order to play their best, they have to look their best. I'm very superstitious and I'm very arrogant when it comes to that. Look good, feel good, play good. Tim Hardaway Jr. It's hard to argue with and players pay so much because the game's greatest groomers can also serve as good luck charms. Just ask Devin Booker. The Sun star got a fresh fade the night before he dropped 70 points in a single game. Money is simply no object for someone like D-Book. He makes over 31 million a season. So if an eye-catching trim is what guarantees the guard a great performance on the floor, then his hoop hairdos are worth every penny. Whether it's creative cuts or classic styles, a player's hairdo is part of their package as an athlete. Those packages often include some pretty wild trims. And you're probably thinking that having locks like Ja Morant is never gonna come cheap. But basketball players pay hundreds for the most simple stylings. Arguably, the most infamous example of a baller overpaying for their perm was when a legend with almost no hair paid over $800 for a cut. Kobe Bryant forked over almost a grand for a trim back in 2014. We don't even want to imagine how much his cuts cost back when Kobe was Froby. This $725 touch-up job came complete with a $108 tip. The Black Mamba made sure that whoever took care of his shaved head was also taken care of. It might just have been that barber's easiest payday. And one look at that invoice, and anyone in their right mind would be considering a career change. Basketball barbershops are serious business, but there is one player that goes against the grain when it comes to his cuts. That man is NBA's resident Aquaman impersonator, Steven Adams. The Kiwi Kid admitted that he stopped getting haircuts because it was costing too much money. Honestly, it was like a budget thing. It was like 60 bucks to get haircuts and it bummed me out, so I stopped getting haircuts and stuff and saved me a bunch of money. Steven Adams. Thanks to Steven's laid back lifestyle, he's happy to let his luscious locks keep growing. Haircuts had a habit of trimming his savings, though it's not like Lord Funaki is gonna go bankrupt anytime soon. The Grizzlies' big man is set to earn $17 million next year. He could surely put aside some cash for a fresh trim. It's not like anyone is asking him to though. Adam's hair has become his trademark look. A $2,000 cut is little more than a drop in the ocean when it comes to the funds of an NBA player. But for us mere mortals, that is truly a crazy amount of money to spend on a haircut.